Hey guys, in this video we'll show you how to remove ads by name. And the first thing we're going to do is save our bookmarks. We'll start off with the Internet Explorer. We want to click on the little star over in the right, down to the drop down, and import and export. From here we want to export our files, and then click next. We'd like to export only our favorites. From here we pick which bookmarks we want, or we can just pick them all. We can pick the location where we want to save them, and I'll rename the file to Bookmarks Explorer. I'm doing this for a reason. Just save and export. As you can see, Bookmarks Explorer has the same icon as Chrome, so you might get confused here. That's why I renamed it. Okay, now we're going to do the same for Google Chrome. Let's open it up. Just resize it. And from the menu, we're going to go down to Bookmark Manager. From here, you probably see all your bookmarks, but as I don't have any at the moment, from the Organize drop-down, we're going to go down to Export Bookmarks to HTML and just save them on the desktop. There we go. Now we'll do the same thing for Firefox. To get to the menu bar, we need to right-click on the very top. From here we go to Show All Bookmarks. Here we import and backup. Pick the location and click save. There we have it. Now that we've done that, we need to go to a specific folder. Click on the Windows icon and type this local app data. We'll start with Chrome and there we have it. Now all we have to do is delete it. Go back and the same thing for Mozilla Firefox. Just delete the file. Now we have to jump back a directory. Click on App Data. From here we go to Roaming. We need to delete this Mozilla file here. Now for Internet Explorer we need to go to the Control Panel. and make sure the view is by small icons. Click on Internet Options, go all the way to the right to Advanced, and we need to Reset Internet Explorer Settings. Just click Reset and we're done. We've prepared a short and sweet optimization guide specifically designed for users who just removed a virus. It's completely free and you don't need to download anything. If you're interested, you can check us out here.